Today topic of discussion is preparation of protein free filtrate PFF. PFF stands for protein free filtrate. It is a protein free blood. When we remove all protein from blood, when we remove all protein from blood, then the remaining specimen name is called protein free filtrate. When we are removing all the protein from blood, the remaining specimen name is called as protein free filtrate. Simply it is called PFF. Second one is preparation of uh, that protein free filtrate. It is prepared by precipitation of protein. How we prepared by precipitation of protein? Removing protein from blood can be done via some technique uh, but uh, that most method why most widely used method name is called as falling view method falling view method now we will discussing falling view method uh, this one is the most used method for precipitation of protein free filtrate this one only mostly used method this method is done before doing laboratory estimation of creatinine urea uric acid in blood when we will do before estimation of creatinine urea and uric acid in blood principles of uh, protein free filtrate all protein in blood are precipitated by anion this anion uh, that are used in the test name is called tungstic tungstic acid tungstic acid only here we are using anion tungstic acid one element sulfuric acid is necessary sulfuric acid is necessary uh, because it helps in the conversion of sodium tungstate into tungstic acid which is very important for this test second important reason the sulfuric acid has uh, the tendency to break rbc which help in the formation of dark brown color from dark red these are the two reason make sulfuric acid uh, is an important element in this test. In this test, uh, we are using sulfuric acid because of two main reason. One is, uh, first main reason is conversion of sodium tungstate into tungstic acid. Second one is formation of dark brown color from red color. So sulfuric acid convert sodium tungstate to tungstic acid then break rbc then procedure for pff first withdraw uh, to a ml of blood this blood transferred into a container which containing sodium potassium oxalate so we uh, withdraw to a ml of blood transfer to a container this container containing potassium ox oxalate then dilute this blood with the help of 14 ml of distilled water then we are adding 14 ml of distilled water diluted then added 2 ml of 10 percentage of uh, sodium tungstate now only we are adding 10 percentage of sodium tungstate plus 67 percentage of sulfuric acid then added uh, 67 percentage of sulfuric acid which convert sodium tungstate into uh, tungstic acid. If that test is going to write, the color of the solution must change dark red to dark brown color. It will change dark red to dark brown color. After that, what we will do? We will filter by using Wattman filter paper. Then that success, uh, how means colorless protein free filtrate obtained this one only successful result that brown color will change to colorless here we are filtering by using Wattman filter paper so collect blood samples that containing container containing potassium oxalate then 14 ml distilled water then 2 ml of 10 percentage 
sodium tungstate then 67 percent is sulfuric acid then by using Wattman filter paper we will filter colorless solution formation indicate positive result <coughs> result we get colorless protein free filterate this one is the statement form Thanks for watching.